If you're looking for the best software tool to use to run your Amazon FBA business, then today I'm gonna to walk you through what is the absolute best tool this year that you can use that does just about everything. Now, the tool is called Zoo. It may sound like kind of a funny name, but it's definitely one that sticks in your mind. And maybe that's why they decided to call it that, but it has been a game changer for us. Now, let me show you just a few of the many features that Zoo has. Now, the first one is a brand new tool they just released called Spotlight. Now, if you've ever done any type of product research using other similar tools, then maybe you've been familiar with the different kinds of filters that you have to put in there. What's the price of the product, the BSR range, all the different categories, reviews, um, anything that you, know, you have to put in there just to create a huge list of tens of thousands of products that don't really help you. And then when you do that, oftentimes you see the exact same product listed over and over and over again. And it doesn't really answer the one question we all want to know is, what are the best products that we can sell? I have X amount of money to spend. I'm interested in this category. Show me the products. That's exactly what Spotlight does. So let me walk you through how to do that. Now, the first thing that Spotlight is going to ask you is, what's your budget? And it doesn't matter whether you have $1,000 or $100,000, Spotlight can help you find products within your budget. And this budget is, what's your budget to buy and have that product shipped all the way to Amazon in order to start selling it? So let's start off with something much more reasonable. Let's say $5,000 for my budget. I'm gonna hit next. And then I just tell Spotlight, what categories am I interested in? You can choose up to five different categories. So I'm gonna choose sports and outdoors, kitchen and dining, patio, lawn and garden. Let's go for uh, home and kitchen and then tools and home improvement. Uh, and then I'm gonna click on find opportunities. And as I do that, Zoof in a matter of seconds, goes through thousands of products in its database and pulls up only those that are good product opportunities for me. Now, one of the really great features about Zoof is that if you don't know which of these products is the best for you, I mean, we already know that they fit our budget. We already know that they're within the categories that we want, but maybe you still are stuck because there are hundreds of products showing up. Well, you can use what's called the Zoof Spotlight Score. And the Spotlight Score is gonna look at three different features. It looks at first, what is the overall profit you can make for each of these products compared to the others. Because if you're selling a product online, the biggest factor that we're all looking for, the biggest thing we're looking for is what kind of profit can I make from it? So Spotlight is gonna go out there and look at the different profits each of these products can make. Next, it's gonna look and see, well, what is the risk associated with this product? And the way that Spotlight looks at risk primarily is how much money is on the line for you to invest in this product and potentially make nothing off of. So then Spotlight's gonna look at what the initial inventory investment is and factor that in. And then the third thing is, what are your chances for success with this product? And this generally means, what's the competition look like? Are your competitors needing tens of thousands of reviews in order to be successful? Or are there a lot of competitors out there that are able to be very successful with a small number of reviews? So it factors in the profit, the risk, and then the competition in order to determine the spotlight score. So if you wanna see what are the best opportunities from Zoof's perspective, just sort by the spotlight score and that'll show you the ones that Zoof is saying has the best opportunity. Now, as we scroll down, we see lots of great products, uh, climbing gloves, hinged interior solid core doors, uh, horse care boots, patio ceiling light fixtures, sundial clocks. A lot of these I'd never heard of before or never would have thought of. I always think of different types of products. I don't know, like the, the GoPro or iPads or cell phone cases, the typical products you think of selling on Amazon. The great thing about Zoof, it doesn't care about any of that. It just knows the data behind it. It knows whether or not this product can make a profit and whether or not it's a good opportunity for you. So as we go through and find good opportunities, one thing you can do is you can add these to what are called your brand. So if I wanna create some kind of outdoor brand, I could add the climbing gloves to my brand. Let's create a new brand called uh, the Mike's Outdoors. And then if I find other related outdoor products, let's imagine the horse care boots are one of them. I can add those to my brand as well. There's Mike's Outdoors. Uh, I'll scroll down, see if there's anything else that looks kind of interesting for me. Uh, let's see, hunting and field dressing accessories. Let's go ahead and add those as well to my outdoor brand. Uh, you'll see that it added all three of those products to my brand. And a nice thing is that it adds all that up and tells you what the potential monthly revenue is if you sold all three of these products. And more importantly, 
what the potential monthly profit is. Because that's something that no other tool out there is able to estimate is the profit. And Zoop does that by looking at the estimated manufacturing costs, uh, the estimated shipping costs, and then everything we know about that product on Amazon. What are the Amazon referral fees? What are the Amazon FBA fees based upon the size? And it even estimates duties as well. So taking all of those costs, some known, some estimated, it factors that in and tells you what the potential profit is for this entire brand. Now, once you use Spotlight to find a product on Zoof, there's lots of other tools inside of Zoof that allow you to launch this product as well on Amazon. One of the features that I like is the reverse ASIN tool because we all know that when you're selling a product on Amazon to create a great listing and to run ads, you have to know what search terms to put into your listing. And Zoof makes that incredibly simple by allowing you to look at your top competitors and figure out exactly what search terms are working for them. So let's go out there and imagine that we were going to sell climbing gloves. So I'm just gonna go out there and pick one of the top selling timing gloves out here. Let's see these intrafit climbing gloves look good. I'm gonna click on it. I am going to copy this ASIN that's right up here inside of the listing. Always comes after the words DP. Uh, I'm gonna copy that. I'm going to go over to the reverse ASIN tool. I'm going to enter it in, hit search. And then Zoop is gonna go through its millions of keywords in its database and automatically tell you which search terms people are using to search for these products. So in this situation, these climbing gloves and which ones are resulting in sales. So as I scroll down, you'll see that Zoo found over 353 different search terms just for this one set of climbing gloves. And one of the really cool features about the reverse ASIN tool that no other tool has is not only is it going to tell you the search volume, so how many times is this search done on Amazon every month, it's also gonna estimate the monthly sales that come from that search term. Now, the reason this is important, because even if something is searched for a lot on Amazon, what's most important is how many times does it end up in a sale on Amazon? So for example, we can see that tree climbing gear has over 5,000 searches monthly and safety harness has over 3,000 searches. But even though safety harness has less searches, it results in almost twice as many sales. That's why the reverse ASIN tool is so powerful. So if I were to go out there and put into my listing or run ads for a search term as Amazon, um, even though tree climbing gear is relevant for this product, I know that people end up searching for safety harness and buying gloves like this even more often. So I would focus more on that one because it's resulting in more sales. And that's just one of the many features of the reverse ASIN. You can see also uh, how many other competing products, what are the average reviews, what's the average review rating for that product, the average price for it, and so, so much more with reverse ASIN. But once you use a reverse ASIN, you can download all the search terms that are relevant for this product and then go out there and include them in your listing. Now, Zoof makes it really simple as well. They have the listing editor. It's going to lie to go out there and create a new listing. So let's say, for example, that we want to create something very similar to those climbing gloves. Um, now, you never want to copy someone else's listing, but if you want to get a head start and see what type of search terms they're putting into their listing, you can actually import an existing listing. I'm going to enter in the exact same ASIN that we just did for those climbing gloves. Click on import. And then you'll see that Zoof automatically imports the title the bullet points, and even what's in the description as well to give you a head start on your listing. Now, another really cool feature of the listing editor is it's going to allow you to enter in all the search terms that you feel are relevant for your listing. And then it's gonna tell you which ones are included in this listing. And what I found already a lot of times, a lot of the big sellers out there are missing out on some key search terms for the product. So let's go back to our reverse ASIN. Let's actually um, pull up the exact same one that we just did. And then I am going to download these search terms so I can export to a CSV. I'm going to open that up. I'm going to copy all of these search terms. Then I'm going to go back over to the listing editor where we just created this listing right here. And I'm going to enter all the keywords we want to include. And then what you'll notice is it's automatically shown us over here which of those search terms are in this top selling listing. And only four are climbing gloves, rope gloves, rappelling, and rock climbing. The ones that are not included are still over here. So for example, tree climbing gear, not included in the listing. So if I were to go over here and enter, for example, um, enter into this bullet point, also the best tree climbing gear available, and then scroll back up, you'll see now that tree climbing gear is shown to be included in this listing. 
So as you go through and create your own listing, you can constantly track what are the best keywords that are already in the listing and which one you need to add into there. It's an incredibly powerful tool to make sure that the listings you create on Amazon have all the right keywords, get all the right searches, and get the most sales possible on Amazon. Now, another great feature inside of Zoof is the ability to automate getting reviews. We all know just how important reviews are to any business on Amazon, and Amazon's really cracked down, and they've limited the ways that you can get reviews. One way that they allow you to get reviews is to click on a little button on every order inside of Amazon and request review manually. Zoof does away for that. They have actually what's called the review automation. And what you can do is that you can go out there and click on this, you add in the product that you're selling, and then Zoof will automatically, every seven days or 10 days, whatever it is, after you ship a product out, they'll automatically request review from the customer that buys that product. And then that way, you never have to do any kind of review request manually. Zoop takes care of all of that for you and completely automates that process. Now, in addition to the tools we just went over, Zoop has so much more out there. Uh, it has a profit calculator that allows you to see the actual profit potential for any product. Uh, if you know what type of keywords you're looking for. So we did a reverse ASIN search. We didn't have any idea what type of keywords people were using for those rock climbing gloves. But if you hey, want to see what types of keywords are related to rock climbing gloves, the keyword finder will find all the related keywords for that. Uh, it has the listing editor we talked about. It is a keyword processor. If you want to go through and kind of scrub a bunch of keywords, remove maybe some commas or dashes, it does all that for you as well. Uh, if you want to check and see if your product is being indexed by Amazon, it has a URL builder. If you want to rotate URLs, like you use certain URLs to get traffic for your product on Amazon, this allows you to rotate that. If you want to see where your product at any point in time is ranking on Amazon, you can do that. When you're launching a product, it has a tool called the Launch Tracker, which allows you to see over time how much your product is spending in ads and how much it's selling and making every single day. So you don't have to track that using spreadsheets and doing it manually. It has a profit dashboard that automatically tracks your exact profits you're making for your Amazon business every day, every month, every year, and forever. Uh, it has also an alerts. So if you wanna find out if your price has been changed on Amazon, or maybe if you got a negative review, or if someone else is listing a product on Amazon, this will notify you in real time. And there's so much more that's constantly being added to Zoof as well. I've used just about every other Amazon software tool out there, and now I'm only using Zoof to run all of my brands and businesses. That's because Zoof has everything for beginners up through advanced sellers like myself. And I'm confident that if you're running or considering building your own Amazon business, Zoof is the perfect tool for you to start off with. And if you wanna try it out right now for 14 days for free and test out everything that I just showed you on here, go ahead and click the button below and you'll get a free 14 day trial. If you don't like it, cancel it within two weeks and you pay nothing. But if you do like it, like myself and so many others have, then you'll have the perfect tool to grow and run your own Amazon business.